I'm not sure if Wario has played as, as, Yoshi's as like a Yoshi, tacos. What are you really watching out for with the Pika? Are you trying to avoid the fares? Well, so the fares are going to happen. I mean, not getting hit at all is really the big one. And you're kind of looking for when they throw out aerials that you're going to be able to armor. Right and also, there, right and there, also, kind of using the disjoint of the back air and up air, and right here, Wario just coming in. We definitely see Yoshi's. Oh, and Wario just a quick flub, and Taco's not able to capitalize on that mistake. Electing to go the other way. Interesting. And he's, oh, he's lucky he did not get punished there. He did the upbeat. A yeah, little, little bit of sloppiness out of both players here. Oh! And the forward air as he's getting off. Wario realized he was going to get back on the ledge. He's like, hold on, I actually can't stand here. That back air will break. Two and it fade off. Uh, let's see, back to square one here. So quick three stock game. Yeah, Tacos does move around like a madman now. Yeah, really nothing like it. He's a he's one of a kind, possibly the savior of Smash 64. Because he will do something awesome at any moment. If anything, the higher the stakes, the better. The better if you do something cool. Wario does seem a little bit nervous. Oh, great try actually with that down air to get a to even think about that. And that grab is really powerful versus Yosh. And this time, oh, Wario, player. this is what Wario does when he realizes that he can't just hold ledge. And Tacos is able to just land and parry. Yeah, I'm actually really interested in how Wario is going to be edge guarding. Like right here, what's he going to do? Back air doesn't Back air gets parry. parried with that up tilt, but that's a good up tilt, though. He's gonna have to figure out and got to love when that works out, when you just win neutral with a certain move, and then you can just, and great read. Great read by Wario, but he actually did it up. Another beautiful recovery by Tacos. And the slow get up makes Wario lose it. Stock at nothing, and all of a sudden it's 3-1. Right, and back air makes it 2-1, a lot more doable. But Wario really should have another life. I'm fortunate that he, I, don't, I guess, I don't know if he thought it would be over. And now, look at that, one. One up air at, at zero, and Yoshi's already coming in hot, you know, like, and Wario knew that that up air, he was like, I, I'll, I touched you, but I'm going to back up. And did he land? And a nice dash tack just in case. And here we go, last stock. Tacos does not play defensive, does he? Tacos spacing these forward airs, I mean, if he punishes one of his landings, and we saw Wario start to go top platform now, and can he take this? Yeah, Wario's adjusting to this new Up. Oh, oh, yeah. Up I think that was great by Tacos to actually stay on the ground there, rather than try and tech because he didn't go as far. Oh, Tacos trying to read with an up smash. Is he going to pay for it? That back air isn't quite going to do it. He chases that roll with the... Oh. Chase the roll with the down air, and Tacos tried to cancel his momentum with that forward air so that he could grab ledge instead of use the full jump. And just killed himself. But hey, Wario killed himself once. Wario started really camping top platform heavy. And yeah, if Tacos is going to lack the pace, and when, I mean, when you're up, however many stocks, too. I think he was up 3-1, wasn't he? Yeah, 3-1, but it was really, uh, he had a high percent at 3-1. It was pretty much 2-1. Two, two, yeah, and Wario did kind of kill himself there. Good DI to put himself back on stage. Alex not to tech away and just tech in place. And the knight, beautiful wait. I keep saying beautiful again. Did he not land? He did land. Oh. And almost lost that stock. That's it. And, oh, that was a great forward air. Good Falling effort, off the ledge to punish the shield get up. That's not something that we've seen from Wario in the past. Did he loot? Did he? Oh, uh, it was able to attack, so we'll never know. Yeah, so he's doing these forward air in forward airs into up tilts. I wonder if edge cancel. Got him. This this might be getting out of hand for Tacos real quick. He's gonna have to adjust to this future. It's a shame because Tacos really could have had that first game. Yes, he could have. And the fastball. Ooh, interesting. Oh! He could have just perfect landed up smash. That's what I was thinking. 
And the parry, another parry. Yeah, you can't, you can't get me. Really needed a DJC back air to chase the tech behind. And Warrior really does not want to get hit by these back airs or up airs. The weak back air hits. Taco's putting an egg by the ledge, but that's a little too early. Warrior doing a great job reacting to these parries after these parries still not getting punished after. Tacos keeps trying to do these techs or these DJCs. Tacos just has to give him ledge and wait for him to land and land a back air right in his face. Warrior trying to get that ledge and Tacos landing a little bit too close. To get punished and maybe wanted to parry there. Good way by Wario. That's the stock. And these forward air up tilts are really working out for him. And the back air breaks. He almost was able to grab ledge, not quite. And now we see Wario with a 3 1 lead. Wario's edge guard. Oh, that was a nice combo starter, but wasn't able to follow up. So good. I'm wondering if he Does he have his jump? Oh, what a. That was a great tech chase by. And that'll be it. I'm Same way that we see Stranded lose to Alvin is that. If Mario was baiting his edge guard options in game one, just to make Tacos jump onto stage more, so now he could get all these grabs in late back air. Because he completely changed how he edge guarded from game one to game two. And Taco is going to go the ditto. Did not like how that Yoshi game went. I hate to see this. And Taco's, Taco's uh, Pika pretty fast. We'll see. I'm sure Wario's... I know he beat Bark Sanchez already. And you know he hasn't really been warming up this Pika, I'm sure. But we'll see how it goes. Taco's definitely a quick player. Possibly able to... I don't know if outspace Wario, but maybe out-tech Wario. I agree with that. And I thought he got that ledge cancel, and maybe Warrior just got there in time. And he catches him with that up air as he's trying to upbeat the top flat. Uh, bad run off there by. He runs off, and then Warrior's like, ah, oh, you're just going to give it to me. I'll back air you. Bring it to the bank, But I guess uh, Taco just had to try something. And that, that up tilt was so nice. Trying to chase him going to the ledge with the down air, but Tacos doesn't even go to the ledge. Oh, definitely didn't want to I think he that. wanted to chase tech with an up smash there. Yeah, and probably. Tacos with a jab and yeah. doing a forward smash probably on shield and gonna oh, almost got punished for it. And now Wario gives it right back. Advantage. Nice ledge cancel there. Running into so many back airs. And Wario is punishing his landing really heavy right now. Uh, I love that angle by Tacos. Using the extended to get all the way and just eating another back air. Tacos doing these jabs like randomly, I guess is, you could tell it's because it's not warmed up. And he tried to fast fall with an up air there. Respect, because it's not hard to do, or not easy to do. But just a little late. And doesn't even try to mess with his shield anymore after that initial attempt. Get to the ledge, looking a little scared. Oh, and actually was a great weight slash not jump by Tacos. Maybe could have up tilted. Oh, oh interesting. Weak air option on Wario. Okay, we got a little up air in the grab. <laughs> Tacos going real low to try and chase him going to ledge, and Wario's like, if you're gonna go down there, I'm just gonna go up top right. Tacos getting punished hard for landing right now in f near Wario. And he keeps doing these runoff double jumps like that. Like he's got to, really got to stop running off. And Wario with two off stage. Both of Wario's stocks that he lost this game are. And look at why does he keep he keeps running off the stage and using his double jump. And Wario's punishing him for it every time. You really hate to see. And again, just jumping up. And then Wario comes in and takes, he's like free real estate. Taco's DI is good enough to get out of the standard Wario Pika combo. So Almost a nice forward, oh. forward tilt read. And catches that yeah. good DI yeah. by Taco's. Oh, what was that, dude? That was. What did I just watch? I, I think he maybe just perfect landed with the up B. 
as he landed on stage as he was able to jump right away. And finally, Taco's winning neutral with a back air of his own. Wario must have was a little late with that up, up, right, up air. And here we go. And just like that, it is last stock. Tacos has 82%. And I know he doesn't want to get and, Yeah, and he has. another back air at the ledge rest. Yeah, he really needs to get out of that spot. Yeah, and then this is the up yeah. And Tacos out in losers. Yeah.